for the championship of the world. That's a tough, clean fight. Protect yourself at all times. Any questions here? No. Any questions? Let's get it on. Come on. Never off balance. There's the right hand by Paez. Closing up the smell of Let's get a look at the quickness of Paez with that sneak roundhouse. This is an example of what happens when a runner turns into a stand-up fighter. He's there to be hit, and he's there to hit more combat. He's getting the chance to land shots inside. Believe me, he can punch. Right on the horse, to hold on to the horn on that feather. Shouldn't be ashamed of it. When Whitaker takes a rest, he gets hit. He should at least three feet from the guy. Ruling exchanges in the center of the ring. Yes. Hot. Hell, got some good body punches in, but wouldn't do anything else. Whitaker should not. He tried to come with the right hand up top, and it was blocked. These uppercuts are landing in target practice for Whitaker. And he's been much more accurate in this. Off the dot. Go right at him. From heart bypass surgery down in Houston, he has our best wishes as he continues that. And I don't think he understands the true punching power that Pernell Whitaker has. He can hit and not put you to sleep. Well, but Paez knows more about it than anybody in the building right now, George, and he does not seem to be phased. But he having the cut to the right eyelid, and now Whitaker plants a straight right on the face. Becoming much more economical now, George. Throwing fewer punches and seeming to target the eye. 